So today, we're gonna be playing uh, That's Not Your Neighbor. Uh, I saw people playing it, and it looked like an interesting but easy game, and so I'm gonna be giving it a shot. Who knows? Maybe I'll just get everybody in this complex eaten, which was usually my MO, but you know, I don't like humanity anyways, so it works out in my favor. Uh, the doppelgangers you let in don't kill you immediately but at the end of the run. You get a score rank at the end of the run according to your performance. Possibly, yeah, la 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 la, rules. Let's kill some people. No one cares about the rules. It's not like they're important or something. Uh, this film's a production of with educational files. If you're watching this film, it's because you're the new doorman in your building. Thank you. Uh, your job is to determine whether the person who wants to enter the building is a doppelganger. This feels very, uh... What's it called? Uh, but some are not good, and it had the uh, generate and perfect. Yeah. Uh, you have to pay close attention to the appearance of your neighbors. Uh, that's good news. Dystopian? Oh, yeah, it is dystopian. It's fun. I suppose, like, also remember to fill out the checklist for each neighbor. You can't miss any detail because it could mean the death for you and your neighbors. See, I could do these little infomercial things. This is the structure of your office. Now we are going to explain how it works. Woo! Love it. Here is the security window. Don't forget to observe very well each individual who approaches. On the right, you have folders with the data. Each neighbor according to the respective floor. Thank you. Now, where's the incinerator? To fill out the checklist, take one of the lists in front of you. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Oh, receive documents from this hatch. I like that we have a hatch. Like, you would think the doppelgangers would be able to get in through that, right? Like, I'm just saying. I've seen YouTubers play this, I think. I think it'd be decent, but I don't want to play. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it doesn't look like it's, it feels like other games that are similar. Like, I played a game that has a similar feel to this, but you had to be like death and like you were helping death determine whether people were supposed to go in the afterlife. And I haven't been listening to any of this explanation. I'm sure it'll be fine. What's the worst that can happen when we all die? Your job's important, la la la, make sure you do it right. Skip. I heard enough. I think I got this. Now, what am I doing? Hi. Welcome and congratulations on your new job. Uh, as you could see on the introductory film, your job is to verify the entry of the neighbors to your building. Each day, there will be a list of individuals who will request entry into the building. It is possible that there are individuals who request entry and aren't on the list. In which case, you will mark on the checklist that they are not on the list to proceed to question the individual. Also, you must verify that the ID and the entry request are correct and have the correct <laughs> log. Don't forget to also check the expiration IDs, month and year. Remember, it's February 1955. I should remember that. Um, I'm just going to put that in chat on my Twitch because I, I know I can see that. <laughs> That's where I'm going to keep that. Good afternoon. Hi, Gloria. A uh, Schmitch. Apartment 2-1. I'm a resident of the building. My apartment is the first on the second floor. So far, you're correct. <laughs> okay. Let's look at this. So, it's 19... Wait, no, it's not. Wait a minute. It's not 1974. It's 1955. Yeah. Um, no. No, what am I supposed to do again? Who am I supposed to call for that? I I just want to see what this does. I wanna I wanna know what what am I supposed to do again? Wait, why am I supposed to listen to those instructions? Oh, okay. We have an ID, but it's not uh, correct. Uh, is it on today's list? Oh yeah, where's my list? Wait a minute, second floor. Gloria, Banker, Schmitch, 
uh, round face, mold, uh, round nose. And, uh, not, I mean, they look the same, but it says she was born in 1974. Oh, it's it expires in 19 years. Okay, I couldn't figure out what that meant. Okay, so it should be bang. You know what? It's fine. She kills everybody. Everyone deserves it. I'm sure, we have a criminal in here somewhere, right? Next. Oh, I'm supposed to close that. <laughs> Hopefully that was fine. Because <laughs> I was supposed to close the door, by the way. <laughs> I've already killed everyone, haven't I? Uh, Marissa left the building and I come for my job as a writer. Schmidt, number two. Why does he have a hat? A big rise, front of eyebrows. Where's the hat? Okay, short round face, short hair. He's a writer. He's got a large, large number. A uh, large, large number that ends in 77228566. Okay, 1971. He has an ID, he has an appearance, he has an entry request, he's on today's list. Complete. Says everything in order? It is indeed, my good sir. Okay, can you open the door for me? Stop talking. No, I gotta close it. And man, at the closing of the door, I'm gonna have a problem. You'd think the birth date would be on there, but they just mentioned the expiration date. Okay, I wasn't really listening to, to the instruction. The milkman? I don't believe that milkman exists. I'm a resident of the building I come from. I just have a thing against milkman. I'm sorry. I really do. I shouldn't, but I do. Oh, I can hear the milkman. He has a long nose, a thin chin, tired eyes, short hair, and he wears a hat. Yeah, I can see that. So, I mean, okay, it's 1964. Francis Mosses. Uh, Francis Mosses. 2355649518954. No, I don't want this. Or I forget what the numbers were. 2355649518995. Yep, okay. You're looking pretty good so far, my good man. Okay, sure. I'm not noticing anything weird. Yeah, I'm not noticing anything weird. I'm, I mean, I don't want to let you in just purely because you're the milkman. There's a theory that one of the characters is actually the milkman's daughter, so they have the same eyes, but hey, that's just a theory. <laughs> you know, I have every right to just kick you out right now, just for the pure fact of that you don't have a request. No. What's up with that? I forgot to show my. Red tree chart. Okay. So you are Bubbles, Margaret. I'm a resident of the building and I went out for my job as a seamstress. I already sense a liar. So she is a seamstress, but I don't know if I just uh, I just don't like that, you know, you gave me a hard time. That's what I don't like. I just don't like you gave me a hard time. Oh, Margaret Bubbles. 1975, 1032680149501032680159050. Seems true. Alright, everything else checks out. Eh. My goal isn't to make anyone survive. Just go in. Wait, is this the list of approved people? Ah, oh, crap. I haven't been checking this whatsoever. Love it. Hello. What is the meaning of life, the universe, and everything? Oh, he's one of these kinds of people. Yeah. That's incorrect! Yeah, I think you're wrong, sir. Goodbye. <laughs> who is that? I have no clue who that is, but oh well. I'm sure it's nothing. Hello. You know, I think that one lady from earlier was probably uh, not supposed to enter. <laughs> into the building, but that's okay. Well, that's the worst thing that could happen. She eats her husband. Um. Hey, yo, where's your request? Here's my entry. Why do y'all keep doing that, okay? Like, y'all being a pain in my buns. <sighs> okay. Uh, first one, a resident of the building on job. It's a model. Yeah. Sever shish. That checks out. What floor are you on again? Floor one, floor number four. Okay, so floor one. 
Oh, good God, there's two of you. I'm on the left cheek for Illinois. Eight, two, five, Twin. Okay, so I'm just a twin. We've got the mold rides out of eight, four, five, six, two, three, zero, one, four, nine, five, six. Gorgeous. Um, what does the phone do? What is this look? What is this? I don't understand what that's supposed to- Ah, you know what? Fuck it. What's the worst thing that can have- Does the ID have the DDP logo? I don't know. I haven't been checking it. Oh. I think I've seen you today. Also, why is my phone now just broken? Okay, I'm a resident. Francis Moses. Moses. I think I already screwed this up royally, huh? 1964. Wait, what? What if I just left both of them up there? Would one of them just kill the other? I'd love that. Um. There's a hat. Tired eyes. He is on the list, but I just let one of you go through. about that. I really don't. Maybe I'll just kill this guy because I just don't want to deal with it. I really don't want to deal with it. Okay, he has an idea. He has an appearance. So is everything in order? Can you open the door for me? You don't to be pushy. If he wasn't being pushy, I would have let him in. But all of a sudden, that pushy demeanor... That's what you deserve. How does this work? I hate this phone. Oh, your contact. So, cleaning protocol completed. Thank you. I think I screwed it up earlier when I let the other guy in. And you can continue your job. Not that I really shouldn't, though. I'm terrible at it. Oh, wait! The calendar had the year on it the whole time. <laughs> I'm glad I realized I'm dumb. Oh, hi! You don't have a mold, so you're gonna die. I didn't even check any other stuff, and I don't care to. I think I called it. I think I did this right. Yeah. Oh, you have time to do it. Thank you. My cleaning protocol complete. I'm just wiping out. If, it, anyway, if there are no residents, there is no one to kill. I thought all the doppelgangers would be super obvious in the first day. Yeah, well, let's think. I just don't like your face, man. But I guess I'll look into you. I'm a resident of the building. Who was he again? What floor are you on? I mean, okay, Isaac Gauze. So big eyebrows, big smile, prominent chin, big nose, big nose, prominent chin, big smile, creepy demeanor. Four, two, five, so four, five, six, nine, eight, five, five, one, two, three, nine, six, nine. Four, five, six, nine, eight, five, five, one, two, three, six, nine. Okay. You know what? Sure. Have fun! What's the worst thing that could happen? He kills everybody? I mean, he wasn't on the list, but, you know. Who cares about the list? Not me. <laughs> oh, Pacino, Pacino. That's funny. Hilarious. Oh, wait, she was on the list. Okay, good. Well, then I did it, but someone know what's supposed to be. That's fun. Okay, floor three, number four. I'm a resident. I'm a lawyer. Okay. Lawyer, resident, 12054809634. Big nose, front of mustache, use the monocle. Where's a hat? <laughs> little thing. I'm just gonna kill everyone over literally every little thing. <laughs> I, uh, I'm just gonna kill everybody over every tiny little inconsistency that I see. I think that's how you're supposed to do it. <laughs> 
being protocol completed. Thank you. I'd rather be overly cautious than underly cautious. I'd actually like to create you guys in as many doppelgangers as possible, but I feel like that's gonna be a hard thing. How long? What's this? Ever dream this clown? No. Every night all over the world, hundreds of people see this clown in their dreams. If this clown appears in your dreams, don't play any game with him. If you do want more information, I'm gonna take a picture of that, because that sounds interesting. That sounds like a new game! It'd be funny if I took a picture of this and it was forever haunted by, like, a stupid little clown. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. Anybody else? Do we even let Mafia members in the building? Uh, he has a scar. Uh, I'm the rest of the building. Public accountant. Okay, public accountant. My butt. Or who the mafia? Uh, big nose, scar, long, one eyebrow, wears a hat, long face, scar on right chin. Accountant. Uh, 483 Romans. Binsley. 4839240596843. Four eight three nine two four zero five nine six eight four. Why does that sound different? Four eight three nine two four zero five nine six eight four. Four eight three nine two zero five nine six eight four. No, that sounds about right. Okay. Well, he's got all the shoots together, so. Yes. See, he learned from the milkman to not ask too many questions. Bigger. Floor one. A shoemaker, long nose, without eyebrows, big nose, had the goatee, Rob Bursky, Peachman. Oh, I can call them? 2668. I didn't know that. That's two. That would have made life so much easier. I'm gonna see if anyone knows this guy. We're setting him up there. Hello, Alberski speaking. My brother is not at home. Okay. And everything checks out. Everything checks out then. You're good. That's all I needed to know. Wait, was that right? Yeah, so there are, so yeah, Alberski. Answer for Robert. Wait a minute. Here we go again. I feel like I've seen Red Boys McCloy. I'm red the building and I've got and I'm back to some stuff. What's your apartment number? I wanna check it out. Three three. Yeah, Steven Red Boys should be able to tell me whether you're good or not. Forty two oh, crap. Forty two what again? Forty two forty two. <laughs> When it's repeated numbers, I never remember them. But when they're not repeated, I'm great. Alright, let's see it. I'm sorry, Dave, but sometimes I have to be dumb and figure things out on my own. My father and I are in the apartment right now. We are not expecting any visitors today. Bad news for you, buddy boy. Yeah, <laughs> true. <laughs> hey man, if I'm not being stupid, I'm not playing the game right. Yay, I'm gonna call him and I'm gonna see what's up. Please clean this up for me. You have contacted the demon. So, cleaning protocol completed. How long is my work day? Like, dang, I feel like I'm actually at work. You can continue your job. It's killing me. It's killing me slowly, this job. Can I go to the vents? Why do I feel like I've already seen you today? Cause I have. Explain it. Uh, two, one. Five, one, two, three. Do 
as long as the numbers are repeated, I got. I don't remember her. She was literally the very first one I did. That's what I thought. My husband and I are in the apartment right now. What I figured. Yep, that's what I figured. See ya, lady. Then she's gonna call me and say, Oh, I forgot I have a twin sister. Yeah, but she was at home, right? And your contact was did it did. But when I called up to the place, she, the lady was there. That's how I'm doing it now. I'm just gonna call up to their apartment if I think something's off. There's someone up there already. Yeah. Woo! I guess. Cyclops Tom. Go away. Well, that was a terrible attempt. Probably the worst I've seen today. Well, the AI moderation doesn't like your name. That sucks, man. Winning. Turn off and bleed it. When does my workday end? Like, dang. You can continue your job. Yeah, it feels like I'm in purgatory. How long is my job? Where's the clock? Where can I punch out? And I just in a simulation of pain and torture? Oh, hi. Just contemplating. Not being here. <laughs> Nacho? Ooh, like nachos. I like nachos. Macadis. Macadis, nachos. I like nachos. My first name is Sai. My last name is <laughs> <laughs> I'm a resident of the building. I come from my job as a chef. Why do I not check, like, what floor they live on before I close their file? Okay, she lives as a chef. Not John McCain. I'm just gonna call up there. 1346. Let's see if there's anybody up there. Why do so many of these names sound Russian? Because maybe this is happening in Russia. Maybe this is a current problem in Russia. Doppelgangers. <laughs> Anastasia speaking. Uh, my mother is not home. Whatever. I'm not sure. Wait a minute. Yeah, so that's Anastasia. Is your mom? Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, right eye blue. Right eye blue, left eye green. So, right eye blue, left eye green. So my right would be flipped. Yeah, that looks about right. And eh, you know what? Screw it. Go kill your daughter. I don't care. It's not my kid, is it? I mean, you're doing better than Cyclops Tom, but you're still doing a terrible job. Did you learn from the other guy that came in here? You're doing terribly. Call it already. It's not gonna be you, son. It's gonna be such a wonderful ant and thing. Oh, I'm already an ant. <laughs> Isn't that just great? <laughs> not my kid. Ethan hunts. Nice. I like that. I can continue my job. My job of character. It's never gonna end. Wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't know that. Why don't they come after me first? Why didn't you, like, eat the other residents? <laughs> Doppelganger's captured. Neighbors killed one. Doppelganger's oh, allowed in two. <laughs> still gotta be. <laughs> How bad do you have to do to get lower than a B? Oh, lovely. Gloria really knows Mia big eyes. How is that supposed to tell if their eyes are big? They look the same. That is the end of this part of That's Not Your Neighbor. Remember to like and subscribe to not miss any future videos. See ya!